Hello, this is Slayerson here for um, a tutorial video for a game called Receiver, which uh, I have 23 hours of gameplay on, which is quite a lot for such a small game that was only made in seven days. Um, of course, uh, there's been a few updates, I think, since then, since the game only originally had the gun called the M1911 pistol. Um, I'm going to be making this tutorial for a few hints and tips, uh, well, um, more like a few tips and also the procedures that are required for reloading in the game because each gun has different mechanics the three guns are the victor 70 revolver i think that's what it's called i'm not 100 percent sure on that one uh i've got the glock 17 in my hand here with full auto mod as you can see and i've also have the m1911 um pistol uh, obviously like i just said so yeah uh this video is going to be in sections so Enjoy. Hints and tips. Okay, so first thing you'll notice is that um, if you've started up the game just now, the actual gun aiming thing is going to be different than what I've got here, so it's going to look like this. Which is a little bit weird for some people, as I can imagine. So I prefer to bring it down as close as I can, but. Um, not too close because if you have a flashlight, uh, the view actually clips through it, so I like to have it about here. And I also like to lock the gun to the center of the screen, and toggle crouch is sort of my peripheral, but again, this is all your, your special stuff, so you don't have to copy me. But feel free to, because I really don't give a crap if you do. Reloading 1. The revolver. Okay. So sometimes you will spawn with a revolver and you will notice that uh, I've actually already put some bullets in there. So I'm just going to say I have four bullets. So you'd want to open up the chamber with E and then add bullets with Z and then press R. And there you go. You've reloaded, well, you've loaded the gun. Now, what if you had to reload? Well, let's say you shoot off two bullets. You'll notice that two of the center parts of the actual, like, shells have actually been cut out because we've shot them so they've been used so they're now no longer any good now if we want to get rid of everything in the chamber we press V now you'll notice some of the bullets tend to expand and get stuck so you have to tap V several times to get them out then you just press G to pick up the ones that are actually good and then tap Z to fill up the chamber press R and there you go and that's pretty much all there is for loading this gun. This gun is has nothing really special about it. Uh, another thing to note is um, I'm just gonna type a cheat in here, uh, just to give an example. Whoops. Okay. So what I've done is I put the game in slow motion. So you'll notice something. If I put the game in slow motion now, and I shoot, there's going to be a couple milliseconds of delay, well more like 200 milliseconds or so, because it has to auto cock itself, so. Now if you want to remove that delay so that you can shoot a, a turret more accurately or something like that, because it's a moving object, uh, you p would hold F until the cock is actually fully down and then you shoot and you'd notice it's actually instant. There you go. Reloading 2. The Glock 17. Okay, so instantly on this gun you'll notice that little cone shaped thing that's on the side. I'll get to that later. Now I'm going to take out the magazine using E. Then I'm going to press the title key which will, there will be a picture of what that looks like in case you don't know what it is. In the picture, I mean in the video, so yeah. And now we're going to take bullets out using R. We're going to press E to drop that. Press 3 to grab the next uh, clip. Press R to take all the bullets out, or hold it, I mean, tap it. Uh, and then we're going to press Z on the new, uh, the last magazine. Fill her up. This is just how I play. Uh, and we're going to grab the gun, and then we're just going to press Z. And there we go. Now you'll notice there's no bullet in the chamber. Now to check the bullet in the chamber, we press R and T at the same time. To load the bullet into the chamber, you press R. Also, a handy tip, if you pick up um, a tape, and you want to pause it, just press X, and then you can press X again to um, play it, and so forth. Now, you'll notice that 
there's that cone shape thing I was talking about. Now this is currently in full auto mode, so if I were to shoot right now, it would shoot many bullets at one time. So I'm going to put it in the single fire mode just so I can test something. So I'm going to shoot this lamp. Oh, sweet. We took it out. Um, now that was single fire mode. Now if I were to put this into full auto mode, you'll see this thing will go crazy and I'll shoot about a whole clip in a matter of about two seconds. I highly don't recommend this unless you have like five bullets in your clip and there's like two drones in your face and you just want to completely destroy them in a matter of seconds. Now also when this the gun does this you can just press T to fix that. And there you go. But uh, I need to load it up with every bullet I have. And there we go. Oh, uh, just let me fix that real quick. Alright, and that concludes this part of the tutorial. Reloading. Part 3. M1911. Okay, so here we have the M1911 pistol here, and it's completely not loaded or anything. Now, instantly you'll want to check the chamber, because sometimes there's a bullet in there, and there's like a 50-50% chance with this gun. I'm not sure if this is a bug or not. But if there's a bullet already in the chamber when you first load, only when you spawn, know the time uh, when using this gun, sometimes you will go to shoot and it won't work. I cannot explain why this happens, I just know it does. So, always press R to take the bullet that's in the chamber out. Now, you'll see that I just like completely emptied that clip, filled up this clip by doing all the same functions that you do with the Glock on this gun. And now I just press R, and there we go, we have a bullet in the chamber, and this gun is ready to fire. Now, if you ever encounter a spawn where the gun looks like this, you can't shoot, can't do anything, all you can do is take out the clip. Uh, just simply press V, and then you all turn off the safety. I don't know why I keep doing that. Um, so, yeah, that concludes this video. Oh, and uh, fun fact, if you don't like your spawn, your, your spawn, not, there's no D in spawn, uh, just hold L, and there you go. Ooh, there's a tape over there. Yay.